for the heart of the matter. Just go, hey, Laporte, new, new, new role play. Uh, I've done this one a couple times on Beer with Claude Fr uh, Saturday, and I did it on uh, the Monday group call. Um, you're all uh, you're you're invited to a, a you're invited to make a presentation in front of a, uh, the board of directors to sell a million dollar airplane. And there's a and there's about 10 other competitors out there. And this is your you're right there. You're on one of these long wooden tables in this really fancy boardroom. And you're there to make a presentation. What's the first thing you say? You have a problem. I'm here to fix a problem. Why am I here? Oh, say it again. Why am I here? Now say it in a, you're in a business setting. Yeah. You got 50 eyeballs, 25 men and women dressed to kill. And, and you're there and you're under armor t-shirt. Okay. And you say what you say, but say it with passion. Let me hear okay. you introduce. This is your first words. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, Alex Aguilar, he came all, he flew in here today. He's going to tell us about his jet airplane that, that can go twice the speed of sound here. Let's give him a few minutes. Okay. Alex, you're on buddy. All right. You hey, ladies and gentlemen. You make a 50% commission on a $2 million airplane. First okay. thing you say, go ahead. Okay. Uh, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Um, what, why am I here today? What, what would you guys like to see from me? Is that a little too forward? No, I love it. All right, go ahead. I love it. I say, well, I'm the CEO, Alex, and um, I appreciate you asking. Um, uh, we need a jet. Um, our people, uh, we sell uh, used liverwurst sandwiches all over the world. And, uh, mm -hmm. you know, we have Southwest Airlines isn't cutting it for us anymore. We need to get that liverwurst on those planes fast. And we need to get our executives and salespeople all over the world. So we need a, we need a reliable, low maintenance, fast jet. That's what well, we you, need. You said reliable, low maintenance, fast jet. Um, how, how come not stick with Southwest? Well, I think I, I, well, no, they're okay. They're slow. You know, liverwurst has a shelf life. Okay. I see. And, so and our guys need to try the faster our guys get to their presentations, the more money we make. And we need to get them all over the country. We need to get them all over the world. And we're we we're we decided that we're budgeted. We're we have budgeted ourselves to get our first executive jet to fly our salespeople around the world. Okay. And well, we're interviewing uh, and we're interviewing several companies like yourself. Okay, well, it, it sounds to me like you guys have a problem, right? Because, I mean, it sounds like you're, you're looking for a reliable company and, and Southwest isn't really meeting your guys' standards. Am I hearing that right? Yeah, it's a big problem because if we don't, there's a lot of competition in the liverwurst business. Yeah, I'm, I'm hearing. Um, well, let, let's suppose. Go to the heart. Um, go, I'll give you a clue and then I'll move. Right. What is the what what goes to the heart and soul of all business people? Money. Go on. You're on. You're back on again. I'm not sure how that related though. Hold up. Okay. Let's go to Alex Bolden. Alex, sure, you're you you step into his shoes. Why, gentlemen, why, ladies and gentlemen, why am I here? I just explained to you why you're here. Great question. Time to ask another question. Maybe about needs and greeds, money, sure. budget. Okay. Okay. Well, how soon are you guys looking to get a new jet? Yesterday. Yesterday. We've interviewed five different companies. You're number six. We got two other guys coming in today. We're going to make a decision by, by Friday. Okay. Well, so what's your budget? Uh, whatever we, you know, um, we don't know. We've heard uh, we've heard jets go for one to five million dollars. We really don't want to spend. We really wa don't want to spend more than two and a half. Okay, so you guys want a fast jet? Unless you, you have financing or something. Okay, okay, that's great. So you guys just want a fast jet? Do you want something with uh, what's the capacity you guys want? How many seats? At least uh, six to twelve. Okay, let's pretend. Uh, suppose I can get you that. A fast jet with uh, six to twelve capacity. Will you be ready to do business today, or should I just walk out now? Well, that's a little abrupt. What do you mean walk out now? You just got here. Hey, I'm, a well, I'm, a, I'm a CEO. I'm a CEO of the world's largest li used liverwurst sandwich company. You, yeah, I'm the you talk to your, pros you talk to your prospects like that. 
I'm just here to solve your problem. I don't, I don't want to waste your time like those other guys did. Okay. Off timeout. What's he missing? What's he missing? A little the nurturing. Stroking and, stroking and nurturing. Nurture. There's three rules. Nurture, nurture, and nurture some more. Nurture me. I understand your problem. Your problem is common in the industry. It's pretty, this isn't cost, but do a redirection. This isn't costing you money because your people can't travel fast and reliable and safe, is it? Boom. Make it. And, and great. I hope you don't mind me asking these questions. I want to learn as much about you and your company as possible so I can get you and your company in the right jet for the right price with the right financing and get it to you sooner rather than later. Are we on the okay. same page, sir? Absolutely. You don't mind me asking these questions and then you ask me a few and then I'll get out of your hair and get out of here with an order, hopefully. Or I can give you a two hour boring slide presentation like the other guys. You pick. All right. Nurture a little, be direct. Okay. Be direct, but nurture. <laughs> Who wants to close? Marnie, you want to close me on that jet? <laughs> sell me that, sell me that two and a half million dollar uh, Cessna Citation jet that I really need bad and I'm sick of listening to salespeople. Go for it. Close. Me. Okay. Okay. Uh, Claude, um, wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Why are we here today? I was wondering the same thing. Uh, you're, um, you're with the jet company? Yeah. Yeah. Was it, a, it was, you were looking for a jet? Oh. Yeah, we need a jet. We need a jet oh. so we can, so our liver oh. salesman can go travel quickly and make more oh. money, make more sales. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. Wow. And we're interviewing all the top jet companies. You're number six. <laughs> number six. Wow. Okay. Well, geez, I'd like to be number one. So, um, interesting. So Claude, if, um, let's see, let me just ask you, we might have a Cessna here for you, a supersonic, um, for, for Cedar, uh, here now. I don't know if this is, uh, we've got a long waiting list though. So, um, just want to ask you a couple questions here. If this, right, can I, how much is that? Um, we're only budgeted for two million, two and a half million dollars. Isn't that a five million dollar jet? Uh, well, it's uh, pretend, you know, pretend it is upsell me, yeah. Sell, sell I mean, me more than I budgeted for. I'm the CEO, okay. Yeah, no, two million, Claude. That's that's a little low for a supersonic four seater Cessna. I mean, you know, you're, oh, you're wow. you know. Yeah, I know. It sounds perfect. Could we, if I made you a commitment, I'm not saying I am. Could we have that jet? Or you said you only have one available. We do only have one available. We have a pretty long waiting list, and, and you know, quite frankly, I was going to be on the phone selling them today. So, so you I want think that? I want that. I want that jet. If we can work out the, can I? If I give you an order for that jet, because we need it bad and we need it fast. Can we have that jet? I don't want to wait. Okay. All right. Um, so, uh, Claude, tell me what your best offer is. Because if you, if we can make a deal today, people don't um, negotiate on jets. <laughs> it, it is what it is. Right. Right. <laughs> who wants? Who wants to close me, Brandon or Hervik? Brand, Hervik, go ahead. Okay. Go, go ahead. Go ahead. Claude, as soon as I could get you that jet, man, and before I get out of this office, you know, we're all on a time schedule. As soon as I can get you that at the price you needed, um, and we're ready to do some business today. I, I'm right. You can't do anything on the price, right? I mean, we're budgeted for three and a half million. I really want that jet. I can come up a little. Can you come down at all? Um, yeah, it's, it's going to be tough, man. You know, we like like uh, Marnie was telling you, there was there's a little bit of a waiting list on these. Then that's the case with these right now. You know, you can't, I wish I could help you If I give you an order and we come up in our budget, uh, can I have that? Can I have that jet that you? Can I have that one jet that you have right now? Claude, I, I, I can go to bat for you, Claude. I can go to bat for you. Assume that I can get that for you today. Are you guys ready to make this deal happen? I'm ready. I'm ready to. I'm going to get in trouble, but go ahead. Off the role play. Brandon Carswell is your senior manager. Call him up while you're in front of me, okay? And 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 Brandon, you let him you let him sell me that jet, okay? But you gotta close you gotta close me first. Say hey before I call my manager and stick my neck out to get you that jet. Are you? I can get a check and a purchase order or a contract from you today. Boom. Close the deal before you make the phone call. You already know Brandon will say yes. 
Go ahead. Uh, like I said, man, I, I, I see you really want this, this jet. I'm going to, I'm going to stick my neck out for you. Go to bat for you. Got to call, um, you know, I got to call Brandon on, on the other line and just confirm with him that I could do this. Uh, if he says that I can, are you ready to move forward and sign off on this today? You really think we can get that jet? I can, I can swing for the fences for you, Claude. Um, but I, I need, need a jet really bad. If you can get me that jet, if you got, you said you have one jet, but you got all these people. If you can get me that new jet, you got an order. You got an order today. I'm sorry. You got to, if you can get me that jet, I need it bad and I need it fast. If you can get it for me, you got an order today. Klaus, you're telling me I make this call. We get a yes on the other line. You're ready to, to sign off on this. You're ready to move forward. And get the jet. Would you like to work for me and sell liverwurst? You're a good salesman, man. I just want to make sure that, uh, you know, I, I, I don't want to waste, you know, like we said, we don't want to waste each other's time. And, and right. Did I say anything to make, in, indicate that I was wasting your time? What do you mean? I mean, nothing of it, Claude. I'm, a, seri a, I'm a serious guy. I'm a CEO of the world's largest liverwurst company. <laughs> yeah, no, yes, you are. That's why I'm here now. That's why I came to, we, you know, we, we have you on the waiting list. We scooted you up some so we could get you this jet. Let me get on this phone and uh, and try to solidify this. For Stroke you. my ego again. What's going on with a guy who's successful already, has made a lot of money, is head of a company? What's what's going what's going on in his head, in his culture, in his personality? He got a big ego. He got a big ego. He's he's already the man. He's already the man. So he's like, hey, I'm trying to get this thing sold. I'm I'm trying to buy this thing. So I need you to go ahead and come on with it. Give him yeah, at this give point. Him a little of like, this. Give him a little yeah, bit. Hey, you know, I like the way you do business, sir. It's obvious why you're successful. Give him a little sugar. Gotcha. When you get a five million dollar contract, who wins? Yeah. You win. You win. Okay. Yeah, call you up. Win. Okay, you got the commitment. Call up Brandon real quick. Hey, Brandon, I, I got a, I got Cloud over here. Um, you know, from from the uh, from the liver sandwich company. <laughs> and uh, he really wants this this jet, man. I, you know, I told him we got a long waiting list, but he's ready to sign off on it. Um, Tell him I'll sign today. He's Tell ready to sign. I'm, today. I'm right here. I'm, I'll sign it right now. I'll give him a hundred thousand dollar deposit. Hundred thousand dollar deposit, Brandon. What, what do you think? Should we? Uh, should we scoop? Hey, up? man, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead and seal the deal. Go ahead and seal it. Go ahead and seal it, man. Okay, sounds good, man. I'll call you right back. No, struggle a little. You're on the phone. Mm -hmm. I can't hear Brandon struggle, go struggle a little, say, you know, Brandon, this is a good guy. I'm sure. Are we going to do other business in the future? Can you give us some referrals and everything? If I take care of you. Hey, Brandon, we, we still, uh, do we have anybody else that's, that's uh, pounding the doors for that, for that one jet we have left? Claude over here, he really wants it, man. He's, he's I really a want, tell him I really need it. He's ready to put the deposit down. He's he knows how this is going to help his business. I mean, they're doing great, and he's good for the money. Like, Brandon, can you? Can we give him a oh man, it's, that's you know you know that's that's one of our last top flyer jets that we have in, 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 the, last in, the, in the inventory. So man, you know it's woo. That's I mean, is he really ready to go right now? Right, right this now. right this. Tell them Brandon, I'll do it right now. Brandon, I told them it's, 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 you know, we have a few left. It's the last one with the leather interior. It's, it's got the, Ooh, you know. <laughs> does it have yeah, a bar? All the specs that he wants. Um, yeah, he, he wants it, Brandon. What do you think? Can we do it for him? I, I know we got the guy. I mean, on the only, only if he can make it happen within the next 30 minutes. Can you uh, make it happen? Claude, uh, I got Brandon over here. He's saying... We, need, we would need to have, you know, get a go. Listen, like, I got this Sharpie pen, this 20-year lifetime guarantee uh, Sharpie pen from Alex. Uh, uh, I'm ready to sign a contract, man. <laughs> hey, Brandon, he just got this new order of Sharpie pens, man. He's ready to use them. Should we just, should we do it? Should we go ahead? He's a good guy. I know, I know we're going to get, you know, he's going to get us some good reports. He's, he's got a lot of people he knows in his network, man. And, and these people are real. They're for real. Hey, is, is, the, is the ink going to be wet or is it going to be dry? If it's going to be wet, we can do it. Hey, Claude, can you can you just uh, just sign off on the paper and just, you know, let, let's just make sure that I'm, pen is working right? I'm ready. Can't you guys take yes for an answer? <laughs> hey, hey, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and take, uh, I'm going to, 
you know, take authority of cloud. We're, we're gonna go, we're gonna go ahead and get you this jet, man. Okay. Just sign up on that paper and let's get it going. We've only got two, three minutes. <laughs> we've only got a couple of minutes left. What did we learn from these role plays? There are a lot of little lessons, real quick. Nurture. What do you mean by nurture? You know, uh, gas them up a little bit. Give them, give them some sugar. But make them feel good about themselves. But if you just give, stroke but if ego, you just give their ego, stroke their ego. Yeah. Oh, great question. You know, I can understand why a man like you, Mr. Bolden, is so successful. Uh, you know, I wish more people would ask me questions or get involved in the business like you are, sir. Good for you. Give them those little things and say it sincerely. Guess what happens when you stroke their ego? What happened when you stroke, you nurture them? What guess what happens? Their, uh, their, their walls come down, the defense mechanism come down and yep. they start to lean in and now, now you got their attention and they're ready, they're ready to kind of go, move forward. You want to make people fall in love with you in social and business situations. All you have to do is initiate a conversation that strokes, that stimulates their ego. So much of sales is likability okay. and trust. You go to 